No other can replace what we had or the memories on the estate I know some of you love me and I know some of you hate In their mind they hate but they're smiling in my face I feel like she only probably love me cause of fame You think these chicks don't wanna give a broke brother brain I'm Here in London with Sneakbo and this man has a ton of buzz on the UK music scene You're in a good place right now Yeah, right now I'm killing it in the UK Don't know my name's Sneakbo Jet ski wave all day What's up with the jet ski wave? What does that mean? Uh, it means three things. Like, it means, basically, it means having fun. It means the ups and downs in life. Like the waves, just basically ups and downs. Or it means you're jet ski waving with a girl. But obviously, I don't think you want me to explain that bit. But. Stay blessed, put some weed in my body all night. I'm high. more about Drake. How did Drake uh, become familiar with you? I mean, there are a lot of rappers. He's obviously been over here for a few times. There are a lot of rappers here in the UK. So how did Drake find you? Um, well, when I watched his interview, he said something about how he was checking out something about London. And then through that, he saw me and he just li he listened to one of my songs. I think it was the one called Touch a Button. And then from there, like he just liked how I was acting. He said he he saw that I was the main person, and he just liked how I was moving my lyrics, all of that. So I think that that's that's the way he got to know me. But if you want to see it, it's on YouTube. It's it's called Drake Talks About Sneaker. And also, what's pretty amazing is he said that your style actually influenced a couple of songs on his last album. Um, and I mean that that must be kind of surreal for you to hear that. Yeah. His song called Cameras, yeah? There's a lyric I use, and when I heard it, before he even said it, that I inspired him, when I heard it, I thought, how can Drake, yeah, like me and Drake are coming with the same stuff, but I know I didn't, I didn't try, I didn't hear it from him first. So he, when, I, when he said it, I wasn't surprised, but then his Take Care song with Rihanna, I don't know, I don't know how I inspired that song, because I've listened to it and none of my lyrics are in it, but, the only thing that's funny about it is everything he says in it. I was going through it at that time. I'm sorry, excuse me, shorty. But you doing because I want another party. GG in the south side parties. Rip bras, then mash up, then mash up, then fall back. And don't chat. It's clap clap for them pagan yaps. Is there a US rapper out there that you, is, is your equivalent? Is there somebody in the US that you feel is, is just like you style wise? Um, I would say Meat Mills. Yeah, definitely Meek Mills, like, when I listen to his songs, it's like I've been through what he's been through, not everything he's been through, but so, certain things he says, I've, I can relate to it, the way he's coming up now and it's just happening for him, like, that's how it's kind of happening for me over here as well, so, yeah, man, I'm proud of him, and I'm, he's, he's not my inspiration, but now he's, it's like he's becoming an inspiration yeah, for me, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, you're seeing how well he's doing. Yeah, but if Tupac was alive, he would definitely be my inspiration, yeah. but... Meek Mill be probably the next. Yeah. Yo, you're done no sneak, bro. I'm on a jet ski wave and you're watching globalgrind.com. Make sure you stay locked out. Here.